You've decided to take the leap into 3D at home, and now you need to figure out what your best move is and which way do you want to go to make sure that you get 3D the way you want it. Unlike the days of those famous red and blue glasses, the technology has transformed, and now we have options. Whether you want to avoid wearing glasses or want to keep sporting that look, there are options available to you out there. Auto Stereoscopic. Not only are we done with the paper glasses, but now we can even skip glasses altogether. Auto Stereoscopic, or Glasses Free 3D, basically fools your brain into thinking it is seeing a 3D image by providing what is called a parallax view, where each eye sees a different image. Pretty good for those who don't look good in glasses. Anaglyph. If you stick to the classic 3D viewing lifestyle, the anaglyph technology is where you would land. Having images presented in two layers, or colors, and are viewed with glasses that allow us to see each one to create the depth we all want to see. That's why we had red and blue in the lenses of those glasses. Each one does its part, and your brain takes it from there. Passive 3D technology. Unlike the more bulky active 3D glasses, now we can take the same technology used in the real 3D theater experience home and use the passive viewing glasses. Lighter and less expensive than active glasses, costing up to $150, the passive glasses are only 20 to 30, and allow for the same full 3D experience by interacting with the polarized pixels on the screen of your TV. Now you're on your couch and at the movies without having to worry about the guy chatting behind you. Lots of options out there, so remember what you heard here when you're doing your shopping. Thank you.